Hi everyone, welcome to my class, the Olusta class, where we teach mathematics and statistics. In today's class, we want to look at how to solve this exponential equation. If 3 raised to power s square over 9 raised to power s is equal to 27, then s is equal to what? So we said if 3 raised to power s square over 9 raised to power s is equal to 27 then we have to find the value of x but before we proceed please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe solution then we have theory raised to power s square over 9 raised to the power s to be equal to 27. This can be rewrite as this implies that we have 3 raised to the power s square s square over 3 raised to the power 2x that is 3 square is 9 2s to be equal to what? 27 is 3 raised to power 3. Then from here, what do we do? Let's cross multiply. From here, we can cross multiply. We cross multiply. Then this can be right as we have 3 raised to power s square to be equal to what? 3 raised to power 2 x dot 3 raised to power 3 but we recall that recall that if you have a raised to power n dot a raised to power m is the same thing as a raised to power n plus m then this implies that we have 3 raised to power S square will be equal to what? 3 raised to the power 2x plus 3. Now they have the same base, the same base. Then this implies that we have S square to be equal to 2x plus then this can be rewrite as s square minus 2x minus 3 equal to 0. This is quadratic equation. So that is s square. If this plus 2 cross the other side will be minus 2s. Then plus 3 cross the other side will be minus 3s is equal to 0. This is quadratic equation. Let's solve by factorization method. Then this can be write as this implies that we have s square minus 3x plus x minus 3 equal to 0. Then this implies that we have x into x minus 3 plus 1 into x minus 3 is equal to 0. Fine. We have this x minus 3 here and x minus 3 here. Then we have x here and we have 1 here. This implies that we have x plus 1 is equal to 0 or x minus 3 equal to 0. Therefore, from here, let's see, we have x plus 1 equal to 0, then our s be equal to minus 1 or or s minus 3 
is equal to zero, then our x is equal to three. Therefore, our corresponding value of x are we have x is equal to minus one or s is equal to three, which can also be right as s is equal to minus one comma three. Answer this is the value of our x. Please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. That is the value of x. Our s is equal to minus one or three. So please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Please subscribe. Thank you. This is how we get the value of x. If you look at the equation here, we have from s square minus 3x plus x minus 1 is equal to 0. Then we have x into x minus 3 plus 1 into x minus 3 is equal to 0. So if you express it as if you want to get it, we have s times s, we give you s square. Then s times 3 will give you minus 3s plus s times 1 will give you x. Then 1 times minus 3 will give you minus 3. So that is how we get that place. Then we have x plus 1 is equal to 0 or x minus 3 is equal to 0. Those are the two values of x. Then we have x plus 1 is equal to 0. Therefore, x will be minus 1. Because if plus 1 cross the other side, it will become minus 1. Or we have x minus 3 is equal to 0. Therefore, x will be equal to what? Plus 3. If minus cross the other side, it will become plus 3. Therefore, our value of x is s is equal to minus 1 or s is equal to 3 so which is also written here s is equal to minus 1 or s is equal to 3 thank you